What's up guys, this is Rissin from RossProTech.com. How you guys doing? I'm doing great. Hopefully you guys are doing great too. Now right before me here, you guys guess it, it's finally done. I finished the water-cooled Xbox One S. It's been like a month long project, but it's finally done. Does it look beautiful? Oh. Let me just rotate this to the side right here. All right guys, isn't she beautiful? This is like a work of art. I've loved every second of this build. Hopefully you guys, you can appreciate this too. So again, it's been a month long, but I, I loved every minute of it. Before I talk about this Xbox, I wanna talk about a future project that I will be working on. Now, some of you guys can probably guess what I'm talking about. Now, a lot of you guys have been commenting. PlayStation 4 Pro, PlayStation 4 Pro, PlayStation 4 Pro. Play. I heard you guys, I've seen all your comments. Yes, I will be water cooling the PlayStation 4 Pro. It's coming soon, probably within the next month. I'm gonna start getting all the parts ready. I will get a whole new uh, cooling setup, new liquid. I will buy a PlayStation 4, so that's gonna be the next big project. If you guys wanna see that project through, like this video. If you guys like this video i know you're into that type of stuff and i will do that project but let's talk about this beast right here oh my gosh she's so sexy i just want to kiss it Mwah. now if this is the first video you guys have seen i have a whole like maybe five videos long series of where i put this thing together again this is a month long process i love every second of it now at the end of this video i'm gonna play back all the clips of me finishing up the build filling up the liquid closing the case putting together the components if you want to see that wait till the end of the video that's that's where I'm gonna fast forward all those clips so you guys can see them. Hey, one thing I wanna talk about, I did change out the radiator. The original radiator that was in here broke. I'm the one who broke it. I, I used the clamps for this fan here and it, they were too tight and they broke the radiator. So I pretty much got the same radiator but, but, but thicker. This is the L Solution Coolstream PE from EK. This is a lot thicker than the other one I had. All right guys, I want you guys to comment. I want your guys' criticism. What did I do right? What did I do wrong? What should I have done? What should I have used? Should I have used other components? Do you like this reservoir? Is there a reservoir you guys think would have been better? Do you like this radiator? Should I drill holes here? Should I use these fittings? Let me know, I love all the criticism. Criticism is good, it helps me grow, it helps the channel grow. Now, see this fan here? This is the original fan. All I did was extend it. I used my solder and some wire and I extended a cable. I didn't want to run into any problems later where the system didn't load because of the fan wasn't connected. So I used the same fan. All right guys, let me turn around to the back so you guys can see the back. I'm just gonna keep flipping it around. That's the back again. Now, in the next video, I'll turn it on. We're gonna test out its performance. I'm gonna get a FLIR thermal camera to get the temps and it should be cool. I'm gonna do some pretty nice B-roll. And the next video should be the last video for this series. So hopefully everything turns out well. Hopefully you guys like this video. All right, so before I close out the video, again, if you wanna see the rest of that build, it's at the end of this video. So watch the final build at the end of this video. I will be fast forwarding throughout the entire process, how I put together the case, how I filled up the liquid, how I put in the components, all the stuff, all the new stuff, all the fittings I used. Watch the end of the video, I think it's like 10 minutes long. I fast forward throughout the entire thing. So if you guys want to see that, it will be at the end of the video. Now that's pretty much it for this rest of this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rasim from RossmoreTech.com and thank you guys for watching.
Yeah.